Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Omega and Alpha version. In the last two parts, we've dealt with Team Magma and Team Aqua. In this part, I thought we were going to fight the gym, but this is going to be more of a let's go to point A to point B uh, part. Except I'm already here. Oh, Wingle! I guess we're going to take a sneak peek and see if I can try to fight the gym, I guess. Ah, I keep running to empty islands. I guess we're, for once, clearing the gym, I guess. I haven't done this in, in a video for a long while. Um, where is the gym again? Over there, yeah. Alright, let's see what this gym is made of. Oh, oh, the psychic powers! Fail. Wait. Well, how do? Oh, I was about to say how do I get off, but that answers my question. Don't you dare! Run! Oh, I see what you're doing. You failed. Fail. Ooh, this, I think this puzzle is pretty much connect the dots. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ha <laughs> ha. Sneaky that they did that. Uh, yeah, I just do this. Ooh, we got ourselves a, uh, a guard here. A creepy-ass guard. Ooh, you failed. And the dots have been connected. So they changed how this place works. Um, yeah, I just go this way. And then prepare myself for the gym battle. Quicker than I expected. So yeah, as all this gym uh, is has not met at my expectations. Though I haven't fought the gym yet, so what do I know? But the point is, they're not the Emerald team where they had four Pokemon. They only have two Pokemon. So I'm only going to use two Pokemon. I'm going to get rid of uh, Metatang because I ain't supposed to have him. I don't want Sharpedo because he doesn't have a Dark type attack. Could learn one, but no. I'm gonna keep Skarmory. Lazykin's just gonna die out there. Yeah, as I said, Sharpedo doesn't have the correct attacks. And Tentacruel may survive a little one turn, but that's all. So that's basically my team. Skarmory and a Sharp uh I call him Sharpedo. Mighty Anna. I might as well also teach them the TM I bought Protect, wherever that is. Protect. Let's see if I actually have the, enough room to do that, though. I 
think I do, but it, it means I have to get rid of offensive capabilities. Yeah, I'm just going to get rid of Steel Wing for now, and then reteach it once the gym's fight's done. Because I think I'm going to want to keep Sand Attack. Ice Fang, it's been nice knowing you, but it's time to say goodbye. Um, actually, I think I got a better idea. Maybe instead of protect, I'll use uh, roost. Let's see how well that does. This fight might be also quick, just to let you know. But I'm also aware of what they're capable of. I think. What? Well, I need to do this puzzle again. Dumb. Can't believe I have to do this all over again. I just did this puzzle. Well, that's a downside to this gym. Oh, oh no. No! Ah! Oh! Alright, after doing that fight, I realized that I'm under-leveled a bit. I didn't even press this button yet. Over here's where I'm supposed to go. Good thing this gym is easy to find out what to do. And, oh yeah, I think I know how to do this. I do it the same way I did before. Ooh. And... Alright, let's do this. Um, actually, I want to give them berries first. Oh, I only have one berry. That sucks. If the Pokemon that's incapable of healing. Ooh. Uh, I might as well also... Uh, Sleep, sleep, sleep. Because one of them knows hypnosis. I don't have one that awakens them from sleep. Yeah, yeah, that sucks. Oh well. I think we're going to lose. By the way, these two are my favorite gym leaders, just for the fact that they're the most unique of the two. Whoa! Hehehe! <laughs> Surprise! Were you surprised? That there are two gym leaders? We're twins! We don't need to talk because... We can... Uh... Uh can each tell what the other is thinking. All our minds, this combination is ours. Can you beat us? Boom! Oh, you're floating! That's a little nice feature they did there. Ooh, you're both kids. You two are younger than I thought. All right.
right, uh, something to know. Sunkern is the dark type answer, and uh, the Luma Stone is mostly the psychic attacker that also has hypnosis. I just remembered that this could be bad because I think he also has a fire attack. Okay, what's that scary moon going to do? Oh, nothing? Oh, I don't even know if he did anything. Come on, pull off this poison, at least. Solar beam. I guess no fire attack. So that's the strategy here for that sun Pokemon. Sunny day and solar beam. Oh, and protection. That's also what the moon thing is capable of. This is the same strategy I did for the last time I fought them. Except it probably won't take as long because um I'm uh, we're just using two Pokemon. Let's just use Protect. Oh, I should have just went out blazing. What a waste of Protect. Well, I got healing permission, and you failed at hypnosis. That's because Hypnosis got nerfed, and it's got lower accuracy, and that's something I kind of forgot. Let's try Protect again. Oh, of course I failed. Oh, Critical Hits! That sucked. Ha, <laughs> Hypnosis. Alright, the tides are against me, but I think the tides will eventually turn if I play my cards right. Now, actually, since he's... well, actually, I don't want to risk it, but I have to. Okay, good, it's just Rock Slide. Oh, Psychic! Oh my god! Oh, that's because it's a critical hit. That's bullshit. Well, at least I know I can beat her, uh, them.